Hey everyone, welcome back to Go Kick Me, your favorite crowdfunding news interviews channel here on YouTube. So today we have Revealed. Reveal LED is the world's first multi wavelength UV light, especially designed for hotel for travelers and photographers. So it's a UV handheld UV light that also works as a regular flashlight to help you see what you don't want to see. When you stay in a hotel room, you expect to find fresh, clean sheets. But is that always the case? Of course not. Yes, in fact, this is one of those germaphobe crowdfunding campaigns. Basically made to turn OCD, germaphobe, whatever type of hypochondriacs, paranoid and force them, trick them, entice them to buy whatever it is. So in this case, guy goes to a hotel. He's about to do a belly flop on the bed. I'm the... <laughs> okay, I'm going to get a little dirtier. I'm the Justine Fairy. Um, I'm, the, I'm the Golden Showers Detector Lady. What are you talking about? I just booked this room. They would have changed the sheets. Well, right. Most hotel rooms are supposed to change their sheets after every guest. However, check this out. Okay, so most are supposed to, or all of them are supposed to. Most of them do. Some of them don't. Anyway, so they, um, yeah, they show you some stats. And she's like, here, let me show you. Revealed. Revealed. Rechargeable UV light is specially designed for travelers. By using multi-wavelength UV and 180 degrees wide angle, Revealed finds hidden fluids that most other UV lights can easily miss. Okay, so yeah, basically find your organic stains on your sheets um and it does regular flashlight too so yeah they're really playing up the whole thing i i think even if the sheets were clean this would definitely show some some stains um so like again these kind of things are playing on flashlight. germophobia just staying very left the designs and are ready to start manufacturing in order to bring revealed to travelers and photographers around the world okay so basically okay let's just look at the traveler case what do you do when you find <laughs> that your sheets are are dirty do you sleep do you pull them up do you do you call housekeeping and get them to put on another pair of dirty sheets that also have stains on them um do you try to sleep on the less stained part of the bed? Uh, do you want if this is really a problem? Just bring your own sheet and like pillowcase. Probably a better idea. Um, some things are better not known. I will say though that the bedspread, which is one of the stats they showed there, the bedspread is almost certainly not very clean. So you should definitely pull that off as soon as. It's basically, is my rule of thumb as a traveler is. Uh, just pull that shit off the bed as soon as you get in there. I've noticed, like, in I stay in a, a lot of Holiday Inn Express because I travel a lot for work lately. Um, they don't even put a bedspread on. A lot of better hotels don't. It's just, like, the comforter. Uh, so, yeah. Stay off the bedspread. Sheets, actually, I think they usually, like, a decent hotel should clean, should, should change them. Um, the other thing that you could do is, you know, whatever, like, mark it or pull the sheets off at the end of the day so at least you know if you stay there a second night if they've cleaned it but then again that's usually your filth right so um anyway yeah what's the point what are you going to find out what are you going to do when you find out um anyway let's just quickly look at you know there's a lot of people talking about you know what they like what they want to add just keep in mind also it turns to a regular flashlight as well as a uv one so what are we talking about um we have the early bird, and I should warn you, this is a scam. Um, I was had this page open for a little while, and it said there was like one left, and then, then of course, it got bought because the number went up. And look, there's five more. So this is some automated thing where it just continuously updates it to make you think like, you, oh, I got to jump in and get the early bird before it disappears. Um, when in fact, that's why only three people have bought this because... You know, they didn't reload and see that, oh, actually, the cheaper one's left. So, um, yeah, 
you're talking $27 even though it was 26 before what happened to that anyway something weird is going on um, yeah so $27 for one is it really worth $27 that looks pretty small actually if that's a smartphone so you gotta have some small palms I think that looks pretty small anyway yeah you can see Deborah Norville talking about dirty bed sheets um, it does two wavelengths of UV if that really makes a big difference I don't know if it really does um, that's what it looks like when it's finding jizz on the bed um, and it's got a built-in rechargeable battery that's okay I guess I don't know how big it is they don't really say um, and so yeah 40 minutes to recharge battery lasts two hours okay that'll last a while I mean, it's LED can't take that bad so anyway um, yeah it has a clip on it so that's kind of nice I guess if you wanted to video your jizz stains um, to document it when you make a lawsuit when you get a skin rash um, anyway I'm just joking but basically yeah then there's some other stuff that you can do with UV lights etc so anyway what do we think about this um, oh wow stretch goal get black that's a really big deal so the question really is okay they've done well like a thousand fifteen 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 thousand fifteen hundred times their goal um, fifteen hundred percent of their goal and uh, yeah 27 bucks what do I think about that well how about this search for UV light for for a lot of things but including for pet urine detection and you get a whole bunch of things with lots of reviews and lots of prices so for almost the same price I could get this gigantic thing for home and hotel inspection pet and urine stains um, I can get a smaller one that does similar wavelengths for only ten dollars and look everybody loves it because only one person reviewed it two thousand people reviewed this thing and yeah they gave it a quite a good rating and it's half the price these come with yellow glasses which apparently help you see the stains better um, yeah there's tons and tons of choices right and some of which have been highly reviewed and oh look this helps spot scorpions so I kind of got curious, like, what the heck is this? Because they all mention it in the in the text as well, like, for finding bed bugs, for finding, like, some of them specifically say, like, head lice. <laughs> some of them specifically say, like, scorpion detectors. Let's see this one. Uh, this one is, like, includes scorpion detection, scorpion hunting. Um, so you can find out when your dog peed somewhere or if there's scorpions in it. Accurate capture. So apparently this is actually a real thing. Um scorpions because they have like an exoskeleton um, there's some kind of uh, proteins in there that the hyal hyaline layer uh, coating on parts of the scorpions is called a cuticle so somehow that really lights up in the uh, black light and then you get stuff like this oh that's creepy so you have to check this out. I got that uh, the black light, and I was shining it as I was walking down the road. And it's a scorpion. So apparently people do this to actually find scorpions, amazingly enough. Um, yeah, there you go. It's not pretty. It's super easy to find, I guess. Uh, you know, no camouflage there. Outsmarted by science. So thank you, uh, scorpion guy. So anyway, um, yeah, there's just tons of them, and they got reviews. And guess what? You can order this. Yeah, there's some scorpion honey. Um, blacklight party. Woo! Counterfeit currency detection. Um, we used to use them. I think I have one somewhere. We used to use it for checking the um, you know, hand stamp at uh, events. But anyway, um, I digress. This one doesn't use rechargeable batteries. Uh, okay. But look, it's only 20 bucks. Um, and I don't know about this one, but some of them include even the glasses at those prices. Um, it's not a toy. Keep that in mind. I guess it can hurt your eyes if you shine it directly in there. Um, this one claims 30 foot. Oh, this one uses six AAA batteries. This is like a super, super big one. Um, it's got 100 LEDs. How many in the other one? 18 watts. Get your scorpions, your bed bugs, your dogs, and your cat pee. 
So the main thing is, like, if I buy this thing, it could be, I could get it within, what's today, the 18th, so I could get it within three or four days. Um, if I was, like, a prime person or if I bought a certain one, um, I'm sure I can probably find some prime ones here if I filtered it or whatever. Um, except I don't have prime. So anyway, uh, you could get it, like, super fast, and you could get it for much less, or you could get a multi-pack, etc., and you could get it this week. Whereas this guy, where's my revealed, will come in May. Okay, it may come in May. It probably won't come in May. It'll probably come in June, July, August. Who knows? Uh, oh, there's a problem in the factory in China. Oh, we added a stretch goal. And now we have to wait for the tool, the tooling to be finished. Yada, yada, yada. I'm over 10 minutes, so I'm going to stop right here. Anyway, moral of the story, skip this guy. Get one of these that has a black light. Get one of these that doesn't have a black light. You got yourself covered. Get some rechargeable batteries. And you're set. And you have it today or next week or whatever. And you know it works. And there's a guy you can return to. And you're not going to wait six months before you can check the next hotel bed that you try to sleep in. Anyway, these have a warranty too. Okay, so see you guys next time here on Go Kick Me. Definitely check us out on Facebook and Twitter at Go Kick Me and also GoKickMedia.com. See you guys later.